Daily Devotionals for July 26. Today's scripture reading will be John 4, verses 3 and 4. He left Judea and departed again to Galilee, but he needed to go through Samaria. The Lord had a purpose. He always had a purpose. He still has a purpose today. There, in this particular setting, he needed to go through Samaria because he was going to have an encounter with the Samaritan woman. And, you know, we may talk about that later, but, you know, she, he read her mail, so to speak. She was the first one that he really told that he was the Messiah. And through that encounter, a great gift of evangelism rose up in her and all of Samaria was saved. The same way today, he's speaking to us and sending us where he needs to go, okay? We're the vessel that takes him. He's not here in the natural like he was then, but he lives in us and he sends us on missions. It could be to the grocery store, it could be to another town, could be to another nation. You know, it's wherever he needs to go to awaken people to the knowledge of Jesus Christ, okay? He, he wants to have encounters with people to bring them to salvation, but he needs us to be willing to go, to follow him and to do the work. So uh, just like this woman, she came out to draw water, you know? You may be at, uh, I say Walmart, you know, and somebody may be looking for a bag of sugar or a loaf of bread, and maybe they can't reach it or something, and the Lord sends you there. You know, it could be that act of kindness with you just helping somebody, and the Lord gives you a word for them. He wants to have an encounter with somebody, and you're the one that he wants to use to do it. So we need to be sensitive to what Holy Spirit is saying to us this day. People need God encounters, okay? And he wants you to be a participant in what he is doing to bring others into the kingdom. It is time of great harvest, but he needs you, it's like Uncle Sam, he needs you, okay? He needs you to be part of this army to come forth and help bring in the harvest, okay? All right, till next time, be blessed.